significance of identity becomes as important as the work, uh, not how it reflects physically in the way that we make art, but the perspective from which we come. Hi, I'm Sanaz Mazinani, and we're here today in my studio. I came into the arts from a background where I was very interested and engaged in political activism and social justice causes. The work that I make takes images from, for example, the internet, online sources such as Google searches, uh, Facebook, or news media sites that are really popular and deal with issues around war and conflict. And then I look at those pictures and kind of evaluate them and think about them and rejuxtapose them and make collages, kaleidoscopic, visual uh, kind of images that come together that speak about these issues. So what I bring to each and every project is this kind of questioning about what is the world like today and how there might be a potential for growth or change. The project that we're working on here today is called Threshold and it includes 12 wall panels, um, all mirrored, and a large 8x8 eight eight sculpture that's going to be in the center of the room, surrounded by the mirrored panels. The sculpture itself is going to have the same surface, and the holes are going to allow you to see through the piece while simultaneously you're being reflected on the piece. So the patterns that are used in the mirrors are all uh, inspired from my own personal heritage. I was born in Iran and really inspired by the Islamic ornamentation that persists there. And the kind of centerpiece of the whole installation is going to be this four panels of video that will be against the back wall. They're actually uh, clips taken from 11 different Hollywood movies. Uh, where I pulled the explosion parts and they kind of follow one another, one after another. And I was really interested in this kind of the power, the pull of the sublime and the darkness of this kind of destructive force that we as humans kind of might relate to. And I want to place it in the center of the space so that when you are walking through, you're seeing yourself reflected but simultaneously seeing these shards and bits of the video as well. I really would love for people to have an experience in the space where uh, they kind of see this kind of the multiples of a perspective. Everyone is very complicated and complex and has these amazing relationships. So the space creates a place where you can approach the same thing from multiple points of view. I like to use images in pop culture because it's what we face every day. We as humans are such visual creatures and we mediate through the world through image. And the way that we experience how life might be elsewhere, somewhere that we've never visited, perhaps what is the world like in Iran or in the Middle East, it's told to us through these narratives, through images. And so this is why I think that it's important to weave that back in to my work for me so that I can remind myself about how much is kind of constructed in this world. Art is incredibly important. No matter how it's formed, what shape it takes, um, making art is bringing something to the world. So whether it's abstract and you just make a mark on the wall, a single line is a process of giving. You know, it's not really consuming. And so that's why I really love making work because it allows spaces for conversation, creates forms for exchange. 